In 2024, NASA will be taking a very significant step in advancing space exploration and innovation. Now, the American Space Agency has chosen the recipients of its 2024 Phase 1 awards, and these awards will financially support these ideas in order to operationalize technologies that can be used in the upcoming missions of the agency. Our next report gets more details. The NASA Innovative Advanced Concepts program deals in cutting-edge ideas. It funds studies to explore potential technologies for real-time use. In 2024, the program is funding at least 13 concepts, ranging from exploring low Earth orbit to venturing into the stars. According to NASA, the combined maximum award is $175,000 in grants. The studies will play a crucial role in evaluating technologies that could shape the future of space missions. The 2024 class of NIAC awardees promises diverse explorations. One standout proposal is from Zhisheng Zha of Coflow Jet LLC in Florida. It suggests the development of Maggie, the first fixed wing electrical vertical takeoff and landing craft designed for mass exploration. Thomas U. Banks of Space Initiatives INC in Florida envisions a swarm of tiny spacecraft traveling to Proxima Centauri, our sun's nearest interstellar neighbor. Using a novel laser sail craft and laser communications, the swarm could provide valuable data about Proxima Centauri. Another noteworthy proposal is from Joe Flandes at NASA's Glenn Research Center in Cleveland. He envisions a spacecraft capable of not only surviving the harsh environment of Venus, but also returning samples from its surface using innovative high-temperature technology and solar aircraft. An innovative concept from Ryan Sprenger of Fauna Bio INC explores the potential of mammalian hibernation, specifically the energy-conserving state known as torpor. The study is aimed at mitigating the physical and mental health risks associated with space travel. It involves investigating torpor in animals to understand its application in space health for humans. The add-on ALF system suggested by Stephen Benner, Foundation for Applied Molecular Evolution from Florida, can be used on all celestial bodies where water will be mined to analyze life indigenous or introduced, Earth-like or alien. The NASA researchers, known as Fellows, will utilize their NIAC grants to operationalize the fundamental premises of their concepts. Bureau Report, Vion, World is One. Vion is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news on the move.